Hi, welcome to Exercise Well with me, Stephanie Mansour. As a certified Pilates instructor, I love encouraging my clients to use a Pilates ring in their Pilates workouts to help them engage their core even more intensely and get a bigger bang for their Pilates buck. So to start, we're gonna begin with a spine stretch forward. So holding on to your Pilates ring on the outside of it, turning and opening your legs as wide as your hips and flexing your feet. Pull your navel in towards your spine and pretend like you're sitting up against a wall. So we have vertebra on top of vertebra stacked up nice and straight, sitting up tall. We're gonna reach the arms in front, relax the shoulders, and then round forward as if we are reaching forward over a beach ball. So keeping the shoulders almost as high as the ears, reaching the ring forward and pulling the abs in away from the front and then coming back to center. So exhaling to move forward and inhaling to come back to center. Next, we're going to add on and do a full roll down with the stretch forward at the top. So deep breath in and exhale, abs in tight, rolling down one vertebra at a time. The low back touches, middle back and upper back, reaching the ring up and then reaching it overhead, making sure that your back doesn't arch off the ground. Pull the abs in and press the back down. And remember that this is a lot trickier because the ring is pulling you backwards. So abs in tight and slowly roll up, chin towards your chest, holding the arms up as high as the ears if possible, and then reaching forward and coming back to center. Repeat this 10 times. Finally, the last exercise is a twist, but holding the ring at your chest so that you maintain the integrity of this twist. This isn't a stretch, this is a core workout and it's working the internal and external obliques. So shoulders relaxed, take a deep breath in, and then exhale, abs in and twist from your waist, keeping this ring as your accountability partner to make sure that you're not over twisting, not from your waist, or over twisting and not using your core. So keep the ring at your chest, abs in tight, and come back to center. Twist to the other side and make sure that that opposite glute is not lifted. It's staying planted onto the ground as you twist, working the area right here, and then come back to center. Twist and center, twist and center. I recommend doing that 10 times to each side. Thanks for watching Exercise Well with me, Stephanie Mansour. Have a great day.